Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to another episode of Castle Flipper, where we continue with our condom. God damn it. <laughs> I can't believe we did that. But yes, as we continue with our condom, uh, some people were saying uh, that, you know, um, this game is, yeah, I didn't even realize it, honestly, for, at first. I should have probably realized it, um, but it actually might be one of the reasons why this game has mixed reviews on Steam. Uh, but the game is very, I guess, very intense on the performance wise and like uh, you're going to need a, a, a computer to run it like in, in a way like you're going to need a, a decent computer. Uh, but you know what? It's actually funny is like as I like come into this game, right? And like honestly, the, the music is like just giving me chills as we sit here. Is that a wolf? That is a wolf. As we come into this game, it really makes me miss uh the uh the medieval kind of just era like i know i've been i've been playing a lot of modern modern stage games and stuff but man i am totally missing this this era and this vibe for sure i mean skyrim i love skyrim i know that's not exactly the same but kingdom come deliverance i mentioned it in the last episode one of my favorite games uh of all time actually so uh yeah um let's go ahead and build a house i guess is, is what we need to do so yeah, let's do that. So what do we need to do? Or how do we do it again? We do tab, right? Tab. And then we have to get our... Wait, is the altar changed? No, no, no. It's the... It's the nothing. It's it's none of this. No, no, no. It's none of this. Absolutely not. Oh, my God. All right. Hang on a sec. All right, so what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to come into the foundations here. We're going to have to make our own foundations. I think we have to buy these. These, uh, I'm not really sure what this is because this doesn't match up with this symbol over here. But I'm assuming it's the same thing. Uh, wow, stairs and, 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 and stairs and all of it, really. Okay. Can we just do like a nice simple foundation here? Okay, maybe not. Okay, maybe we need a tall foundation. Okay, yeah, that's what it is. Or whatever this is. It doesn't seem tall, but, you know, it is It is what it is. Let's go ahead and, like, you know, I guess we could, like, center it off, kind of, in a way. Let's go ahead and just plop it down. So there we go. We got one. We got two. We could put it, like, three and four. And I think I'm going to do that. Three and four. So four foundations. And we could, I guess, technically expand it if we wanted to. But for right now, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just uh, I'm going to just go by uh, what the game is, is suggesting for the most part. Um, so let's go ahead and go back into the inventory here. And Well, actually, no, I guess now we, we build it right or because we, we need walls. Obviously, uh, maybe we do need to buy the walls. Um, so let's do. Yeah, let's do the walls. Um, how do I want to do this? I want to do. Ooh, wall right there. Have the back. You know what? Have it all walled off except for the front here. And the front will have a singular window, right? We will have one window. And that, that you know, that is primed to be disaster if there was ever attacking forces. But we're not, we're not there, I guess, right? So there we go. We got the door. We got all that. And let's go ahead and get a roof in. Just a simple roof, nothing too fancy here. I just want a simple roof. Um, and we had it that way facing last time. So what if we did this way? Let's do this way. Ah, uh, this, what a peaceful game this is. Yeah, I kind of like this. Dun, 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 dun. There we go, fantastic. All right, so now that we have everything like, you know, built out for the most part here, uh, now we can start, oh wait. Yeah, now we can start doing the altar, right? Is it the altar? Fine plaster, old wood. Hmm, pristine the rock, smooth rock. I think for this, I, ah, plaster though, fine plaster. We have wood and we have old wood. Let's do old wood. Now I wonder if this costs, oh. Oh, I kind of like that. Now I'm gonna test this out though. So if we did altar, right? If we did altar and we did regular wood. Okay, so this does cost materials. All right, that's good to know. What about fine plaster? Okay, lack of the materials. We just don't have any plaster. I think plaster maybe and all that will be stone. I kind of like the old wood though. So let's stick with the old wood. Kind of brightens it up a little bit, right? I like that a lot. And it might fit for like a first house type thing, right? So there we go. There we are. There we are. And then of course the ground. The old wood. 
I could have probably put like the new wood there, but that's okay. Boom. All right. So that's our like shack, right? That's our little shack that we have. It looks, you know, it looks cute for the most part. Um, and then let's go ahead and like uh, add a door. How do we add the the door again? Was it the uh, it was it altar, right? No, no, no. I think it might be through the inventory themselves. Yeah. So bedroom, kitchen, bathroom, garden, miscellaneous. Oh, I love that. Look at that. You can put animals. <gasps> what? You can put a freaking a goose, a bunny, a freaking duck. I don't even know what the hell that is. But geese is gooses. What else can you put? Oh, you can put a lot of different things. Oh, that's fantastic. Kitchen accessories, of course. Fireplaces. A lot of different kinds of fireplaces. Curtains. Uh, rugs, flags, paintings, and oh, really, mirrors and lighting, of course. Uh, but all I want to do is, yeah, add a door. And what kind of door goes with this? Well, it's gonna be this door right here. This door goes right there. Yeah, that, that was that was pretty good. Let's go back to the inventory and grab some window shanty, or I don't know the proper name to this. Dude, you can have a balcony. Extras. Wonder if that's like kind of like part of the chimney thing too. So yeah, let's stick simple. There we go. It's going to open it up. There we go. Now let's go ahead and actually add some things. I know the, the game isn't saying like you need to add anything, but I, I, I honestly couldn't be happy with myself if, if I just left it how it is. So look at that. That's like a simple bed. And I think that actually goes inside of some of these, uh, these frames here, which is what I was kind of wondering about in the last episode. So let's just do a simple bed here. A nice place to lay our head and as you can see it's all wood so that means i guess you put a mattress right oh baby look at that I, again i don't know why they don't just like put it one in one you know put it all together you can actually sleep in this game that's kind of cool so there we go we done did that get some wardrobe and uh closets going on and there's a lot of more like there's a lot more options in this uh than it was when we were you know building something for for the game I, I'm, I'm I'm intentionally trying to make this like a very uh, very cheap right very cheap looking uh, you know first home kind of thing. So there we go, got a nice little shelf. What about some uh, nightstand action? Yeah, do we have a, like a cheap little nightstand that we can have? Ooh, that kind of looks. That is not. That is big. That is big. Shelving. Well, I guess it's not considered nightstand. It is considered shelving. Uh, but we are trying to make it a nightstand. Maybe no nightstand. Maybe they didn't have nightstands back in this age. Um, anything else in the bedroom that we can add? No, no, not really. We could add some chairs, some tables, and some shelvings, of course. Bathroom, wash tubs, bassins. I don't know what a bassin is. Garden and miscellaneous. It's going to add some kitchen stuff because we do need a do need a table, I think. Indeed. Question is, is like the size of the table. And one thing I did read in the uh, in in the game or in like the mixed reviews was uh, the sizing issue. So I I saw that a lot of people were kind of upset with <clears throat> how big things certain things were and how uh, how small certain things were. Mostly big, mostly big. People were like, dude, these, some of the objects in this game need to be toned down a bit. So I am like on on edge here, kind of trying to see like what that entail. Like, yeah, that I. I I think I understand now. Um, this is uh, this is a chair for Shrek. Um, this is not for us. Hopefully, that's not every chair in this category. It it, it seems as if it is. <laughs> okay, this is for a friggin' giant. So here you go. You got your your, your chairs and your tables. Uh, very you know very large chairs. And that's not like, it's not, I mean, it's not good, obviously, right? It's not good <coughs> at all, but, um, excuse me. Uh, however, it's not like a make or break situation for, or for me, at least. I mean, I mean, for other people, people can be very upset. Oh, I spent X amount of money on this and, and, and you can't, you know, you can't make a chair the proper height. What, what are you doing? Like, that's not a big deal for me. It really is. I know it, it, it will most likely get fixed uh, later on anyways. So I'm kind of just surfing here with all this knowledge of cool stuff so there we go fantastic yeah i kind of just decorating just going about my business now 
Let's see here. Some paintings. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm, uh, I'm about the painting. How much? Oh, I haven't even noticed if this is taking money out of our, or this is taking currency out of our, out of our money, I guess, quote unquote. Uh, I have not even chucked that yet. What if we did that? Okay, so it is taking money out of it. So it, that is considered money. Just a different, you know, symbol, emblem uh, than the actual one. Uh, again, it will get fixed over time, most likely, right? Let's put a mirror. Uh, where would we put a mirror? Maybe we would put a mirror above the table, just so, uh, you know, you can remind yourself that you're not that big, actually, uh, with the chairs. There you go. No reflection for the mirrors. Um, <clears throat> it's a little upsetting. Like, maybe I'm not, like, expecting a, a person to, to go through there, but maybe a different color than just a black hole. Uh, it would probably be something I would expect there. Uh, let's see here. What do we what do we got here? Some candles. We got to have some candles, some form of lighting. Uh, definitely for sure. I, you know, nightstand probably, right? They don't have alarm clocks back in this day, I don't think. Um, <clears throat> which I wonder how they woke up back then. Like, like, you know, how we do today where it's like a, a must. Like we need to have, uh, you know, an alarm system to, to wake us up. Maybe they had different kinds of, uh, uh, systems or operations when it came to like, uh, waking up. Maybe they had, I don't know, like... The sun would would shine and it would push. This, this makes no freaking sense, but it would it would make an effect on something and that something would push something that would ring a bell or I don't even know, dude. I don't even know. I don't even know where I'm going with that. But there we go. We have that done. Uh, kitchen accessories. Yeah, we could add some kitchen accessories for sure. Is that a broom? Oh, oh my god! <laughs> even the broom! Holy crap, dude! The broom is like seven feet tall that's amazing all right anything else kitchenware i think uh, i think i might have read that the kitchen stuff was like the stuff that was very very huge in a way maybe let's go ahead and add like a few things here no we can't no adding that all right well so much for that uh, i don't even know what the hell this is like a rock or a piece of bread is that what it is i guess it is a piece of bread we'll just throw it right there there's your bread and there's your oh this is a plate okay so there's your plate oh my god it's the same color as the freaking you can't even tell the difference between that and the in the okay all right that in the uh in the in the in the freaking table dude and you can't even stack them all oh, come on all right now i'm starting to see where people have a little bit issues or, or a little bit of issues with the game um let's just put that over here where it's not the same texture Still very difficult to see, my lord. All right, uh, a crate. Um, honestly, I don't think we're at that stage yet. How about a cup? Is a cup okay? Eh, yeah, it's okay, but I can't put it on the table still. Can't even put it on there. Interesting. All right, what else do we have here? What 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 is this? Like a hanging thing of utensils? That that's cool. I really like that, and that kind of works out. It's not too big either. What about like a what is this? A stein? I think that's what these are called, right? There we go. And then, like, one right there. Fantastic. And then what else do we have here? We, we I mean, we're not putting a freaking uh, fireplace for sure. Oh, yes. Books. 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 I would like to put books on this. Is that possible? That was the whole idea was to kind of put books there. Maybe I can put books here. I mean, yeah. Okay. It's a little bit better. How about this? This is a freaking vase? Oh, my God. This is a big vase. Uh, no, we don't need the vase. Can we put, um, sh holy crap, a freaking knight's armor? I don't think we need that quite yet. There's a chest, ladder, uh, the accordion size pushing thingy. I don't know what the official name of it is. Um, and then a freaking diamond studded chair. No, that's not diamond. I'm just kidding. Can we put this up here at least? Okay, we can. Maybe this is how I'll stack. I'll do multiple books of this. Kind of have them at it like a weird, like, angle maybe. Not all kind of like the same, you know. He kind of just throws them up there. He he takes them off of the shelf and then he he puts them up there when he's done, you know, stuff like that. Anything else? I think we're pretty much good. I mean, we could put like a freaking duck in here or a pig, but I, you know, I don't I don't think we're 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 there yet. Let's just shut the door. All right. So let's go ahead and look at our objective here. Oh God. Oh God. Where? Huh? What? Where did that come from? 
Oh my god, what is this called? The workshop? Workshop, this is a workshop. Use it to change the name of your town. Create your own banner or unlock new furniture. Really? Okay. I'd like to see what this is all about. Can I, like, change the name of my kingdom? <laughs> Rename your kingdom. Yes. Um... Uh, You're welcome. All right. Customize your banner. Yes, I want to do that as well. Unlock the new furniture. That's actually really good. Uh, so let's, like, customize our banner. I'm not really good when it comes to, like, you know, customizing things. But, uh, you know, it, it is what it is, right? Let's go ahead and change the symbol. What would be a cool symbol to have? Oh, I love that. First of all, I love that. So the dog already, hands on. One of the... That's kind of cool. <laughs> uh, one of the best ones so far. What the hell? That's like a troll. I think the dog might... Oh, oh, you know what we could do? We could do like a... Um, we'll do this, right? We'll do this. Um, can we change the color? Yeah, change the color of the symbol, please. I want it to be a bright red. What frame are we in? Okay. Can we have like no frame? Maybe not. Oh my god. Oh my god. These frames are going out of control. Let's just do something simple. Like a very simple, like small frame. Like that, I guess. Frame. And then we'll we'll change that accordingly. The background though. Do I do this? Can I oh there we go. That's what I'm looking for. Like that, right? Like horizontal. Or is it like that? I can't remember. Oh my god. If you know what I'm going for here, uh, hands on deck for you. Do like that, and then like... And then like... Like that? <laughs> I, I might be doing this completely wrong. Let's see here. Uh, maybe one way horizontal? Or vertical? No, horizontal for sure. Like, it's not like that. You know, I, I could just look up the picture. Let me just look up the picture. Hang on. Okay, I kind of got the idea now. For the most part. Uh, let's go back to, yes, this. That. Let me just double check that. Yeah, okay, so the green is on the bottom. So the green's on the bottom. So that's that's kind of what I'm going for right there. So let's do let's change our flag to that. Absolutely. And if you don't know what that is, uh Okay, but if you do know what that is, haha. Uh -huh, you should know. It's a country. Alright. Welcome to the furniture. So let's go ahead and unlock, I guess, furniture. Are you sure you want to unlock this item for the cost of 1,000 gold? Do we have money to burn? Absolutely. So I guess we get what? One. What the hell is going on here? Oh, it's a puzzle. Oh, dude. Do you, have, do you have to put the puzzle together? To actually unlock it? Because if you do... Crap. <laughs> I guess it's not too bad, right? There we go. Okay, puzzle. Great. New furniture has been unlocked. Okay, cool. Oh, that was neat. Okay, so, you know, you do, like, shelving. That's a, that's a new way. It is a little laborious. I, I'll, I'll give it that. But, eh, you know, I like it. Regardless, $2,000. Let's do that one. Put the corner pieces where the corner pieces need to go. I'm not good when it comes to puzzles. Like... Me and Danielle, we do, we do, we do okay. Well, that's not where that goes. We, we do okay. Um, or I do okay. She's way better at puzzles than I am. There we are. Nice. New furniture has been unlocked. All right. So that's, that's a cool idea. I wonder if there will be even more because this is all that it has right now. So I wonder if there'll be more. Like, what is this? I wonder. I got an entire building. So there we go. All right. Great. Uh, this was like really cool. Interact. All right. So now what? Now that we have owned our piece of land, I guess we go to our board, maybe. Time for cleanup. All right, so that's that's a quest. AA captain. All right, I I captain. Um, how do I turn in? What? Oh, maybe quest here. 
Talent tree. Oh, dude, we can get our talent. We have three skill points. All right, so let's see here. We get a backpack. You can carry an additional item. A negotiator. All item prices are 10% cheaper. I kind of like that. I mean, we haven't had any, like, trouble with carrying items, so I'm going to go there. And what is this? Compass. Shows you objects you need to repair. That probably would be helpful as well. Oh, another skill tree. Recover 10% more coins after destruction. That's probably a good one to have, too, as well yeah yeah we'll do that as well there we go quest log nothing all right so i guess own our piece of land is is good i guess it's good right i guess we don't need to do anything or turn anything in. i guess we can kind of go to the next one right let me actually go ahead and uh, make sure i have my timer up there we go all right so let's see here um time for a cleanup you know let's do i i captain sir a rumor has it that your sir that you, that you, sir, are the greatest renovator our lands have ever borne. I hope you're not too busy, and there is a chance you'd be kind and help with me, help with my problem. You see, my beloved Uncle Wilfred, uh, bequeathed, bequeath, be, dude, I don't even know. To me, a small island. It's not much, and the whole place has definitely seen better days. But it's an awful slander to reject your uncle's will. Thus, I accepted the gift. The island is deserted, and there is nothing else but a run-down house and an old boat. As much as I couldn't care less about the issue, the or the house, the boat sounds promising. I'd love to sail far into the horizon, but considering its current estate, the only place this boat can take me is to the bottom of the sea. I hope you can find me or help me fulfill my dreams, so I can help you fill your pockets. P.S. Anything you find in the house is yours. Sincerely. Edmund Winslow. So we got garbage stains, remove, remove, repair, repair, catch all the rats, and then fix the chair for a reward of $7,000. Oh my god. Let's do it. Aye, aye, Captain. Alright, so we're gonna be on a boat. This is kind of cool. So I love that the game, I mean, obviously it's called, well, are we gonna be on a boat or are we gonna be on that little island over there with the, with the, with the house? I'm gonna save what I'm about to say until I see what we're about to do. So there is one note and there's four chests. Yeah, I think this is kind of safe to say. I love that we can, one, castle flipper, you do castles. Two, you do houses. Three, you can go onto boats. I love it. I love it a lot, actually. So let's see here. Tab to destroy. Uh, yeah, let's, I guess, destroy everything that needs to be destroyed out here. Boom, boom. And I don't even know if these necessarily need to be destroyed, but I am destroying them. Oh, remove trunk and trees. Okay, so the trunks need to go. There we go. There we go. All right, so five trunks are done. Oh, here it looks like there is a chest here. You love to see it. Thank you. $500. That is insane. A new item has been... Oh, something happened to us as far as new items go. Let's go ahead and interact with that. Clean this up. Take the boards off the window. And I love it. I just love it. I love all of this. Like, look at that. Look how cool that is. I think that's so cool. All right. Let's go inside and see what the damage is. Okay, a little bit, you know, just a little bit of mess. Not too bad. Not too bad indeed. Easy to clean up. Easy to clean up. Oh my god. I don't know what I just did. Was that like... We just picked up some cockroaches? I mean, that's straight from, you know, House Flipper, but my god. Let's go upstairs. Anything that needs to be moved can be moved. I'm not even worried about uh, upright... Well, maybe I should. There we go. And I did. All right. So in the middle of me saying I shouldn't worry about it, I did worry about it, and uh, I did pick it up. So this one is non pick upable That's a little bit of an issue here. How many chests were there? There's four chests in this uh, in this land or in this uh, in this uh, mission here. Keeps going up though. I really like how this house is built. We have to repair. We will repair everything when we come back down. Go ahead and put that. Put this over here. Maybe right here in the corner. Fantastic. Looking pretty good. I will come back and do the stains as well. There we go. I think I put that in backwards. I did. I can't live on, would live with myself if I, if I have that there backwards. Oh, God. Okay, so maybe we go out on the porch where we find a chest. Fantastic. There we go. A thousand. Dude, we have like money for days and we're going to get $7,000 for this job. I think it's safe to say that you can definitely earn a lot of Thank you for the keys. I think you can earn a lot of money uh, in this game fairly easily. Fairly easily. Fairly easily, of course. 
All right, let's go up to the last level, I, I, I presume. And it is the last level here. Or last, uh, you know. Yeah, last level, I guess. Isn't, I'm not trying. I, I say level and I think of like, what? I think of like, you know, boss fight. No, that's not where I'm at here. Let's go and clean up everything that needed to be cleaned up in here. Any stains? Any stains? I don't I don't think so. I think we're pretty much, pretty much good on this part. All right, let's go ahead and move back downstairs. Let's repair everything that needs to be repaired on this level. Being this. Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. Oh, nail? Wait, what? Oh, that's so cool. Oh, I see. It goes down more. Okay, I see. I see. I was like, why is it in going in? Because you actually have to nail it in. Oh, cool. I have a chair. Achievement unlocked. That's really cool. Okay, so that, that's, a, that's a cool thing. I like the repair system in this. Let's repair this again. Do that, 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 that. Push in our nails. Pop it. Pop it. There. I guess the two hitter is fine. Yep, two hitter is A-OK. -okay. There we go. Do it again. Fantastic. All right, great. I like that a lot, actually. It's really cool. Let's go ahead and clean up what we need to be cleaning up in here as well. Get our broom out. I'm going to go up and down just to see. I guess it doesn't matter. Any other stains in here? Don't think so. Do not think so. Hello? Nope. I think this room is okay. I think it's okay. Let me just double check the moss. Yep, the moss is not cleanable. That's all right. More stuff to clean. Yeah, so this game is pretty cool. Um, it's pretty cool so far, for sure. I love the medieval type thing. I, I, I just find that pretty good. So stains, there's two of 10 stains, of course. Uh, anything that needs to be repaired in here. Let's see. That does not. Anything in here needs to be repaired? No, nope, doesn't look like it. I think we're pretty much good. Okay. Let's go to interact there. Go downstairs. No, there is some stains down here for sure. Yeah, absolutely. So I guess it looks like we're going to have to clean. Yeah, we're going to have to clean. Yeah, repair the deck, repair the rudder, repair the ship. We are going to have to clean the house and, uh, you know, fix up the house. Also cleaning the house or cleaning the boat and fixing up the boat as well. So that's cool. So you can do a little bit of this and that for sure. It's not just a, uh, hey, you have to repair or flip houses or flip uh, bungalows or flip castles. You get to also kind of help flip, not flip, but because um, flip, when I think of flip, I'm thinking like, oh, you fix up the house and then you sell the house. It doesn't seem like that's the thing here. And I, I doubt like they have housing markets back in this age, um, of course, but. You know, I get it. Like, it's a, it's a castle flipper. It's a castle, uh, you know, it's a castle redoer, I guess. Renovator. You could probably have named it Castle Renovation, but that's all right. There you go. There we are. All right, let's go to the boat, finally, and get what needs to be done here. Still looking for two more chests, and we are still looking for a note to read. Oh, my God, there's all the rats. I can see the rats now. Good Lord, they're big. Now, I wonder if they have, like, an option. They, I don't think they have an option now, but maybe in the future. Kind of what, uh, oh, God. Kind of what uh, House Flipper did. Um, maybe down in the future, they uh, they add a setting to where you don't have to have rats and maybe something else. Because in House Flipper, you can have the option to have cockroaches or to have, um, to have glass instead. And that's kind of like next level stuff, right? Like, um next level thinking when it comes to the devs uh, because they are thinking about people that have phobias and stuff like that maybe people have like rat phobias and stuff like that and you know honestly you, you know a lot of games you could be like well if you know you have a phobia maybe you shouldn't be playing that yeah but this game and house flipper and castle flipper i mean you got to think like it's 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 aimed at a very uh like easy going audience like uh like a easy going gamer for to say i guess um you know the casual gamer for sure Absolutely. There we go. We still need one plank over there. Don't know where we're going to get that. Pick that up. Pick that up. Oh, I love the music, though. Dun -dun. That f I don't even know what instrument that is, but it is going off. It's having its own solo, and I love it. 
How are we doing on the stains? We are doing 6 of 10 almost. 6 of 10 on the stains. So we do have a couple more. Still looking to see. Oh, here we go. What is this for? I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure what this is for. It's for something. I think our key goes to this room right here, though. Maybe. Uh-oh. Oh, there's the note. Anything over here that I need to repair? Because there is... Oh. There we go. I haven't seen anything regarding this. Let me double check over here. Oh, there's a chest. All right, so here's our third chest. Not our last chest, but our third chest. So there's a thousand gold as well. Might as well just like read the note here while we're here. Trek plans. To-do list. Stabilize the shaft. Straighten the rope tie. Reduce the axle stress. So that's it. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and clean up what we need to clean up. Yeah, we dropped everything. I mean, that's okay because I just don't know exactly what we need those for yet. We are going to need them. I just don't know where. Maybe at the bottom of the boat, probably. Let's go ahead. You know what? I'll pick them up anyways because we probably will need them at the bottom of the boat. What is this? Anything there? Nope. I might have to clean that up. Pick up. Oh. Oh, we can pick up those too. Oh, fantastic. All right. Let's just let's just go downstairs and see what we're cooking with. Oh my god, the freaking rats. <laughs> all, right. all right. All right. All right. All right. Just go buy them. Just go buy them. There we go. Just go buy them again. So we know what these big bad boys are for. They are definitely for uh, patching up the sides here. Oh, there's our other plank that we needed. Um, okay, pretty much good there. Let's go this way. Let's go. F actually, let's go fill up that that hole up here. There we go. We have repaired the deck. Let's go back downstairs. I like that you can have multiple items in your hand. Like, uh, like obviously, yeah, you can have stack them in your hand and everything. But I mean, like, it's good that you can have multiple various items in your hand. Um, I find that uh, kind of helpful. Really helpful in a lot, indeed. Am I missing it? Okay. Doesn't seem like it needs to be in here. Uh, let's go ahead and drop a few things here as we clean up what needs to be cleaned up down here. Not repair, but cleaned up. Do that. Do that. That. Oh, oh, nope, not that. This will be eight. Yep, stain number eight. We still need to repair the entire ship and then repair the rudder. Now, I wonder if we have to, like, go on the outside of the, uh, of the, of the ship to repair it. That would be kind of spicy. Like, you don't think they put us in the water, do you? I don't know, dude. Let's go ahead and get the rats that need to be getting gotten. Achievement unlocked. Rat catcher. You love to see it. All right. Oh, right here. Right in front of us. And I like that there is a day and night, night cycle. Um, I don't think we've had a job where we were in the nighttime yet. I don't think. So it's going to be interesting going forward. It does. When it gets dark, it does get pretty dark, though. Now, we went up here and cleaned that. I don't think we've gone up there yet, so that's probably where our uh, other supplies need to be done. Ooh. Oh, I see. Ah, nice. Yes. Okay, so that is where that goes. So let's go back down there and grab those. There we go. Thank you. Hey, can we grab these ones here? Nice, we can. Okay, good. Bring them up. The rudder. So this is the rudder, right? <laughs> I mean, I would call it the steering wheel. But yeah, that's the rudder. There you go. Great. Now, where is the other part of the ship that needs to be repaired? I think this is where we're going to be our other chest. Oh, no, it's not. But I do see where we do need to repair. There's one. How are we doing? How are we doing on that? Still a lot more that needs to be progressed there. Let's go ahead and drop. Oh, wait. Maybe upstairs. Yeah, or up the ladder. There's the other chest. You love it. All right. How much? A thousand gold indeed. Oh, baby. All right. Let's go back down here. Drop all of that and bring up our stain cleaner. And will I do 100%? Uh, maybe. Maybe I'll do 100%. We'll see. This should be 10 out of 10, though, on the stains. Uh, because there is two trash, technically, around. And that could be anywhere. It could be at the house. It could be here. Um, so I don't know if I'll do 100%, but we'll see. As long as we get the job done, I guess that's all that matters. There we are. Mission complete. Nice. 
You have completed the quest. However, you can complete the cleanup for an additional reward. Yeah, so again, I don't think we're going to be doing that. $7,000 is still a lot of money, at least for us for right now. I don't know. I don't know how it's going to be going forward. But let's go back to the house and see how we did. So the Trojan Gondom is where we go back to. <laughs> or where we go back to. All right. Fantastic. All right, no quests for now. All right, cool. Cool, so that did uh, that didn't end up fixing itself anyways. So as we go over here, we got a couple more things on the board here. We have uh, time for cleanup, which I think we had before. Then we have a good lesson, and then we have build a new house, which, uh, oh baby. <laughs> but I think that's going to do it in today's episode. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, please make sure to hit that like, and I will see you in the next episode as we continue with the Castle Flipper. Oh baby, with the Trojan condom. All right, take care. If you ever feel the same, it doesn't matter the time or place, just sing.